Today we're talking about this stuff, green coffee bean extract. Is it the real deal or is it just another fitness fad and should you save your money and spend it on something else? Let's find out right now. Welcome back everybody. It's great to see you again at Titan Training. Here we talk about everything from kit reviews, supplements, nutrition, performance exercise, everything like that. So for anyone that's already a subscriber, thank you. And for anyone that's not, consider hitting the button down below so you can stay up to date with what we do. Now today we're talking about green coffee bean extract. Is it the real deal or is it just another fitness fad? Let's find out. All coffee actually starts out green and it's only the roasting process that turns it the brown we're a little bit more familiar with. Now what we're being told about green coffee bean extract is that green coffee beans, when they're roasted, lose the magical ingredient, and that magical ingredient is chlorogenic acid. So if we get the extract that still has that in, that's what's gonna help us achieve those fat loss and weight loss goals. Now what's been suggested is that chlorogenic acid can slow down or prevent the release of glucose into the bloodstream after you've eaten. The trouble is, most of the chlorogenic acid studies that have been done, they suck. The biggest study that's being quoted, and it's been quoted for years, is a study of 16 people. That's a study of 16 people for a product that's sold in over 100 retailers in this country alone. And it's even worse when you find out that that study and most of the others were paid for and sponsored by the people that make the product and by the people that want to sell you the product, the retailers. So we can just discount that straight away. Now, the other thing is, guys, we know that green coffee bean extract also contains caffeine. And what do we know about caffeine? Well, that has been proven time and again to boost your metabolism. So maybe the reason the control group in this 16-person study did better than the placebo group was because they had caffeine in there. I'm just making my own observations, but maybe that's the case. Now, green coffee bean extract as a weight loss supplement is only going to go up in popularity. It has been for years because people love to back something they think they can make money on. Sadly, it's even found its way into energy bars on the high street. And we found these in loads of different shops. But the reality is that even if this green coffee bean extract works, a lot of these bars have tiny amounts of it in and they just love to stick it on the front. For instance, this one's got 0.007% green coffee bean extract. Pointless. Don't buy it, don't spend your money on it. It's a complete waste of time. There are far more proven, effective, and efficient methods to help you lose fat and lose weight out there. And you just don't need to spend your money on green coffee bean extract. But if you wanna try it and you wanna see if it works for you, give it a go. But at the moment, there's not enough scientific backing to make me wanna put my money into it. And I don't think you guys should either. Now guys, I hope you found this video useful. And if you have, like the video and subscribe to the channel. Now, if there's a product, supplement, or a piece of kit you wanna see us talk about next, comment down below. And I'm gonna to reply to as many as I can. The best suggestion is the one we're gonna pick and we're gonna make a video about next. Once again, guys, thank you for tuning in. You've been great. And I hope to see you again on Titan Training.